So this is how to arrange a platter. This is how to arrange your small chops when you are doing a platter. You put your tray down first, then you arrange your samosa. Today we are arranging 10 samosa, 5 spring rolls. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, then 10. This is your samosa. Then we're arranging the spring rolls now. One, two, three, four, five. That's five spring rolls. So we have arranged the spring rolls and the samosa. Now we're arranging the puff puff. We are putting 30 puff puff. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four. 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. So this platter has mosa plantain in it. We're adding 10 mosa plantain. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, nine and ten so what is left now is for us to add the chicken gizzard or turkey any protein that is going with it will be added here we're adding turkey to this one two three Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So this is the platter that contains spring rolls, samosa, puff puff, mosa plantain, and turkey. So we'll put toothpick, then we'll wrap it. Our toothpick, just put toothpick by the sides like this. And if you have branded toothpick that you still want to add, something to indicate that this is your brand, just put it, then you foil it, I mean you cling film it. You can film your small chops to avoid spillage or necessary pampering. You add that to avoid unnecessary tampering with your order because you know sometimes dispatch guys can be funny. So once you seal it with a clean film you are safe this is your ceiling this is the way you seal seal this way
so this is okay now i cut off the nylon from here i cut it off and i put any sticker i want to put on the edge on the top of the platter after sealing This can still double for your address notes. So, this is the end of our flat platter. We have finished plating it. We just keep it in the nylon that we deliver like that. Make sure you use cello tape or use a rubber band to hold the nylon you'll be putting this inside. Thank you. Please kindly subscribe, follow, and give me a thumbs up. Put on your notification also so that you know when I drop new videos.